On October the 14th, 1947, United States Air Force pilot Chuck Yeager became the first person to officially break the sound barrier in the experimental Bell X-1. Welcome to History Pod. The quest to break the sound barrier was a significant challenge for aviation pioneers. At the time, many believed that as an aircraft approached the speed of sound, it would encounter insurmountable turbulence and face almost certain destruction. This mysterious barrier, known as Mach 1, equated to about 761 miles per hour at sea level, although lower air density at higher altitudes makes supersonic flight more attainable. Chuck Yeager, a decorated World War II fighter pilot, became a test pilot for the National Advisory Committee for Aeronautics after the war. He was approached to break the sound barrier after another pilot demanded $150,000 due to the perceived risks. On the 14th of October 1947, Jaeger's Bell X-1, named Glamorous Glenis after his wife, was drop-launched from the bomb bay of a B-29 bomber. Levelling out at 45,000 feet over the Rogers Dry Lake of the Mojave Desert in California, Jaeger reached Mach 1.06, or approximately 700 miles per hour. News of the successful flight was kept from the public for eight months, but he was later awarded the Mackay Trophy and the Collier Trophy for the mission. Chuck Yeager's successful supersonic flight had significant consequences for aviation and military technology as it shattered the long-held belief that the sound barrier was an impassable obstacle. This achievement opened the door to a new era of high-speed, high-altitude flight and paved the way for the advanced jet aircraft that were to dominate the Cold War and opened the possibility of human space travel. <laughs> 